These are my top 9 tips to improve your gaming laptop that you need to know about. Oh, and you don't want to miss the secret 10th tip at the end. Number 1. An external screen can boost FPS in games by 17% on average. This only applies to laptops that use Optimus, so if Intel or AMD integrated graphics show in Task Manager. Number 2. Raise the back of your laptop up a bit. The intake fans underneath can get more air, and this can lower temperatures and increase performance. A cooling pad with fans should do a bit better if you've got more space. Number 3. Plug in to wall power for best performance and battery longevity. Many laptops perform much worse on battery power, and needlessly going through recharge and discharge cycles continuously is a good way to reduce the battery lifespan. Number 4. Limit battery charge level. Although I think you should plug in where possible, staying at 100% charge all the time is bad for the battery. Many modern gaming laptops will let you limit the charge level. If you do use the battery often, I would just let it charge to 100%, but if you're on wall power mostly, then consider a lower charge limit. Number 5. Increase battery life. If you do need to run on battery, then considering lowering the screen brightness as much as practical. If you've got a high refresh rate gaming panel, turn it down to 60Hz. If you've got a MUX switch, make sure you're using Optimus. Turn off or lower any other lighting, set a lower performance mode, and customize the power settings in Windows. Undervolting may help too. Number 6. Performance Tuning Undervolting and overclocking are good options to squeeze out extra performance from your gaming laptop. Undervolting can also lower temperatures as you're using less power. Number 7. Use dual channel memory. Put simply, if your gaming laptop has two memory slots but you only have one memory stick, you're leaving performance on the table. Number 8. Calibrate the screen so colors look better. This requires a physical tool that's probably not worth buying unless you're a professional creator, but you can try and download an ICC profile for your screen model that might be better than nothing, assuming your laptop didn't already come calibrated from the factory. Number 9. Change thermal paste. It depends on what sort of paste was used at the factory, but often swapping to a more premium paste can lower CPU and GPU temperatures by a few degrees. And if your gaming laptop's thermal throttling, that will boost performance. And as a bonus, number 10, perhaps most importantly of all, make sure your RGB lighting is on for an FPS boost in games. Or if RGB isn't your thing, then set all the lighting to red so it'll run faster. <laughs> Alright, maybe forget tip number 10. I've covered many of these topics in this video in more depth in the videos linked down in the description if you need more details. And let me know if you've got any more tips for gaming laptop owners down in the comments.